Here's my hard drive. What I've done is taken a Delrin block to give me a plastic block and insulate my uh, timing mechanism, which is just a safety pin that I've stretched out. It rides against this hub and it is timed by a piece of Teflon tape around half of the hub so that it can't touch the pin except when I want to engage the solenoid. But here's the solenoid mechanism. What I found was that there are two magnets in here and on the back side of the head there are coils. When I energize those you can see that it retracts the head and with enough force just using three volts to do some work. So I got to wondering what would happen if I connected and timed this right? Could I make a motor out of just the components and not have to add an extra solenoid? Now here I've added a connecting rod to go between the pin on the shaft on the center hub over to the pin on the head assembly which is my solenoid so that it can pull this around. Again the timing is done with the uh, against the hub using this safety pin. It doesn't have much power at a volt at three volts but it does get going as soon as I bring it off of the uh, place where it's insulated and energizes it should start up. And there we go. It's up and running. Goes at a pretty decent speed. And using only the extra parts of the Delrun, the battery, a safety pin, a couple of screws to make the, the connecting points there, and the rod itself made out of brass, and mostly it is just the hard drive itself.